फाइव किंगडम सिस्टम फाइव किंगडम सिस्टम वॉज क्लासीफाइड बाई रॉबर्ट वाइट एकर इन नाइनटीन सिक्सटी नाइन द बेसिक फीचर्स ऑफ फाइव किंगडम सिस्टम आर इज फॉलोज दैट इज स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द सेल मोड ऑफ दियर न्यूट्रिशन इंटर रिलेशनशिप अमंग द ऑर्गेनिजम्स इट्स बॉडी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन एंड मोड ऑफ न्यूट्रिशन रेप्रोडक्शन फाइव किंगडम सिस्टम इंक्लूड्स किंगडम मुनीरा किंगडम प्रोटेस्टा किंगडम फंजाई किंगडम प्लांटी एंड किंगडम एनिमेलिया जनरल कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ फाइव किंगडम सिस्टम आर इज फॉलोज किंगडम नंबर वन इज किंगडम मुनीरा किंगडम मुनीरा कंजिस्ट ऑफ ऑल प्रोक्रियोटिक ऑर्गेनिजम्स प्रोक्रियोटिक ऑर्गेनिजम्स मीन्स दैट इज प्रो मीन्स बिफोर एंड क्रियॉन मीन्स न्यूक्लियस so the kingdom munira includes all those organisms that lay membrane bounded nucleus number second character is the leak membrane bounded organelles also for example endoplasmic reticulum mitochondria plastids lysosomes vacuoles etc they are all unicellular simplest in colonial organisms their cell wall is made up of murin that is made up of sugar and amino acids they have small size ribosomes about 70s cell division occur by binary fission the means that there is no mitosis or meiosis occurs they may be autotrophic or heterotrophic and both aerobic and anaerobic respiration takes place in those organisms uh, second kingdom is kingdom protasta this kingdom include those organisms which have both plant and animal like characters but mostly they are animal like characters except uh, the presence of chlorophyll and these organisms are more complex than the prokaryotic organisms of kingdom monera other characteristics of this kingdom are is they are all eukaryotic organisms they are unicellular colonial or simple multicellular organisms they are mostly animal like and they are motile means locomotory organs are present in those organisms they also possesses two nucleus and other membrane bounded organelles for example mitochondria golgi bodies etc they may be autotrophic or heterotrophic organisms they may be animal like plant like or fungal like organisms uh, number third one is kingdom fungi kingdom fungi includes those organisms which have plant and animal like characters they are all eukaryotes and multicellular organisms they are all non motile they are all heterotrophic and get nutrients by absorption their cell wall is made of chitin 
they have thallus like body means their body cannot different cannot be differentiated into stem root and leaves and their body is made up of mycelium which may be septate or non septate they may be parasites saprophytes or symbionts and their body like chlorophyll number 4 kingdom is kingdom plantae this kingdom contains both aquatic and terrestrial plants their general characteristic are that they are all eukaryotes and multicellular organisms they are non motile they are all autotrophs their cell wall is made up of cellulose they like centrioles they have vegetative bodies that is stem root and leaves are present and their life cycle show clear alternation of generation sexual in a sexual both reproductions are present and their uh, during their cell division the cytokinesis occurs with the help of a plate number 5 is kingdom animalia kingdom animalia includes eukaryotic and multicellular organisms these organisms are aquatic or terrestrial in nature they are all motile organisms they have heterotrophic mode of nutrition their body live by ingesting and digesting food cell wall is absent while the centrioles are present sexual or asexual reproduction takes place in kingdom animalia cell division takes place through mitosis and meiosis examples of five kingdom system are kingdom monera Includes bacteria, cyanobacteria, etc. Here we we will take some examples of all these kingdoms. So this is also the diagram of bacterial cell and while well, in the cyanobacteria, the example is nostoc. Kingdom Protista includes, for example, Euglena, Chlamydomonas. paramecium etc fungi includes bread mold mushrooms etc while the plantae a diverse group it includes rose wheat ferns banana mango apples etc and the kingdom animalia includes both vertebrates and invertebrates invertebrates for example earthworms starfish etc while in vertebrates for example amphibians reptiles birds mammals etc